Y'all ever wonder why Kamora and Kim Porter were just so close, so tight as friends? Y'all ever wonder, wonder why? Because before it was P. Diddy, it was Russell. Russell wanted P. Diddy's mentors to tell him how to do what he's doing. See, before P. Diddy even got with Kim Porter, Russell's with her first. And Russell's with her, same way he's with Kamora, underage. He met Kamora when she was in high school. He went to her prom with her. So he groomed her the whole way. Needless to say, yes, yes, Russ was at the Diddy parties. But this ain't about him. This is more about Kamora. But let's let's let Russ say something about himself. Still to date, I have never spoken to a policeman about anything. I have never spoken to a judge, civil or criminal, about anything. Uh, from what I can tell, Joe Biden, Bill Clinton, President Trump all have more credible claims against them than I do, if you ask Oprah. Again, I've never been charged with a who took nine lie detector tests, seven of which from the chairman of the polygraph. Did Bill Clinton do that? Did Joe Biden do that? Did President Trump do that? Knock it off. I love you. I just don't want my friends attacked. And I wish you all the, the best. But just leave my friends alone. Don't attack them for visiting me. Attack friend for visiting Trump. He's been convicted. Um, knock it off. Again, I'll be in New York next week. I'll be at the Mercer Hotel. I'll be working, not hiding. And, um, and I'm going to wish you all a beautiful evening. Now, if you know anything, Russell's laying low. You know, waiting for the heat to go down. But, yeah, let's get back to Kamora. Kamora was taken advantage of, um, and nobody did anything about it. You know, nobody said anything about it. Everybody allowed it to happen because of Russell. And Russell is one of the OGs when it comes to these parties and this type of uh, deviant behavior. You know, a lot of people, like Diddy, yeah, Diddy, Diddy. But Russell going to get his own series in this, in this whole thing, too, because Russell has affected a lot of people. He had three cases on him which is why he ran and hid out in Bali. See, everybody thinking, like, if you don't know, you know, you thinking he just went because he got tired of America. No, he went to the Roman Polanski route. That's the route he went. Because remember, before it was a Diddy party, it was a Russell party. So let's not forget that. As you know, um, Kamara got married again. That didn't work out. Uh, her, that husband turned out to be a scammer. But, you know, at this point, I really can't, her bad decisions, is not really based on her logic because you got to remember this man scooped her up when she was young and he put a lot of bs in her mind so she doesn't operate the same way as a person who was able to go through healthy relationships would operate but some of y'all had this weird attitude that if a woman stays then she's asking for it what, what so what about what are we gonna say about kamora because she again was scooped up at 17 only thing she knew at that time was russell so what are we gonna say about that you know also, before I go, could we stop with this whole Hugh Hefner thing? One crime doesn't negate another, all right? We can't dig up Hugh Hefner, but we can do something about Diddy and Russell. 